hey guys welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another deep cleaning series my name is nosa girl if you're new here please consider subscribing so that you can join this beautiful and clean family yes we do a lot of cleaning and we also do a lot of cooking so if you love food like me if you love to be clean then join this family already okay guys today i'm going to be showing you how to deep clean your washing machine yeah i'm in my laundry room right now yeah, so we're going to be deep cleaning the washing machine and I'm going to be using all natural products. That's what I use for, you know, my cleaning. These products are very, very affordable and accessible to you wherever you are. You can get them in your local supermarket. And it's also a very healthy way of cleaning, you know, instead of using chemicals, you can just easily use all of these products right here. I'm going to be showing you very soon. Yeah, and this method is the easiest, fastest, and best way of achieving a very clean washing machine. So stick around and watch this video. I hope you get motivated and do a cleaning like this. Let's get into it. These are the products we're gonna be using today. I have four products right here. This is my scrubbing sponge. This is baking soda. And this is my white vinegar. This thing is magic and so is this. And so is this. <laughs> And here I have a paper towel. You can also use a, a microfiber cloth, like a, a napkin, a kitchen napkin, a towel. Yeah, but I just prefer using this because I can easily toss it into the, the trash can. Yeah, so let's see what we have here. I just did some laundry this morning and here I have some gunk just on the door. All around you can see that and so is my washing machine itself look in there look at all that all of these build ups you know from all this time I've been washing and doing stuff it is really really bad but we have four products that are gonna do the magic so let's get into it Okay, I'm back in my awkward position. <laughs> Just know that there's going to be a lot of funny, awkward position in this video. So first, I'm going to grab my paper towel. I'm just going to cut just a little bit of this. Okay, like so. And then I am going to put some of the vinegar on here. Oh my God, this thing is quite heavy. <laughs> Okay, so I'm just going to put a little bit of this here. Ooh. Okay, that was good enough. And I am going to clean here. So, like so. Told you this method is very very quick easy healthy you don't really have to do much I mean this is literally the much that I'm gonna be doing the machine is gonna do most of the job brand new again <laughs> okay I'm also gonna be cleaning the front of the door I don't like so you can play some music in the background just to make it you know more exciting and fun <laughs> but you guys know I'm gonna be talking talking so I don't think I don't think I'm gonna play some music because I have to talk to you guys okay so that will do for that so here i have my scrubbing sponge and this part of the machine it's very dirty it has a lot of mold so i'm going to try to use this thing you know to wash it off now you can put a little bit of uh, dishwasher soap you know to remove the mold i already put some dishwasher soap and I'm just gonna scrub, 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 scrub. Let's get into it. Yeah. 
you guys the build up and the mold on this thing it's not a joke it's very serious it's very stubborn but we're gonna try So after washing, I'm going to clean it up with a paper towel, like this. So after I clean that up, I'm also going to use a paper towel. This time, I'm going to put some of the white vinegar. Wow, this thing is really heavy. And then I'm gonna use this, you know, just to wipe the surface and see if we can get all of the stains to disappear. Okay, so after I'm done cleaning the door and the front part of the washing machine, we're going to move up now. So now, just open your dispenser. And I'm going to pour in two cups of the white vinegar. I'm actually just eyeballing this. So now I'm going to turn on my washing machine. So this is a setting that you want to put it on. Speed wash. And it's on very high heat. It's extra high and it's going to be on for 15 minutes. And just turn it on. And that, the, and the white vinegar is going to, you know, wash and clean inside the washing machine so let's leave this on for 15 minutes okay so while that is washing you can go and take a break you know take a power nap eat something you know just do something but i am going to be cleaning you know on top of the machine and just all around it i mean it's gonna be it's gonna be on for 15 minutes so you, you can do this what i'm gonna do now or you can just go relax but if you want to do what i'm doing right now then sit down and let's do it together so again i'm gonna get my paper towel and i'm gonna put some vinegar on here tell me this method is not easy i think it is super easy So guys it has washed for 15 minutes and now this is what i'm gonna do now i'm gonna open up the door like this and pour in some baking soda <laughs> sophie's crying i'm gonna pour in some baking soda just inside the machine like this i didn't really measure this i'm just gonna eyeball it but i think about one cup or one and a half cup would do so like that and i'll let it wash for another 15 minutes so yeah just like before i'm gonna put this on speed wash very high heat and super hot and i'll be back in 15 minutes okay why this is washing 
this time I'm going to go grab a snack for the next 15 minutes. So come, come, come. So here I'm gonna grab some cracker. Mm. 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 Gotta eat some food. Need some energy for the deep cleaning. <laughs> Come join me. So it's now 15 minutes since I left it washing. And now I'm going to do a smell check. I just want to be sure that the baking soda has removed that very bad smell. Oh my God. It smells very nice i mean it's really not like a perfume but it smells good it's better than that very bad smell you know that comes out after washing so yeah let me bring you guys closer so you can see what we have achieved today look at how shiny that is so is the front door Let me bring it closer. Sparkling clean. Well, I'm giving you a 360 degree <laughs> show off of my machine. And here is the inside. Here is the front part. We're not completely able to remove all of this, but oh well. It is better than it was before. So just so you know, don't leave your machine for a long time, you know, after using it, make sure to always clean it up, you know, at least twice a month or three times a month, just depending on how much you wash or how much you use the, the machine. But I am okay with this result. I think it is 99% clean for me. I love it. It smells very good. This is inside the machine. It looks brand new. The white vinegar did a great job, you know, cleaning it up and making it shiny. And the, and the baking soda gave it a very good smell. All of that awful smell is gone. So I am super happy with my job today. So I'll just say, do not keep your washing machine for that long. Make sure to always wash it as often as possible after you do a load of laundry. So you don't keep, you know, mold and, you know, dirt building up and then it becomes very difficult. But I'm going to try other methods and I'm going to let you know whatever I do or whatever I did to get a perfect, perfect 100% spotless result. But for today, I am very okay with what I have. It smells great. It looks brand new from outside and even inside right here. It looks very, very clean. Um, and always make sure to leave the door of your washing machine open after you do a load so that all the smell, you know, can go out. Yeah. So guys, oh, we have come to today's, we have come to the end of today's deep cleaning. I hope you enjoyed watching today's video. I hope you have learned something and I hope you will try it out. Please let me know in the comment section if you enjoyed today's video. Subscribe if you have not like this video share this video and i will see you guys in my next one bye bye